two boys play in an hour-long soccer game. At the end of the game, one boy says to the other, I got to play two-thirds of the game. His friend says, well, I got to play two-ninths. Who got to play a longer amount of time? Here we have the two fractions written out, two-thirds and two-ninths, which is a larger fraction. They have the same numerator, they have common numerators, and they have different denominators they are uncommon. Two-thirds or two-ninths. Let's take a look at a clock and see what we can learn about an hour. Here we have an old-fashioned clock, and we're going to go ahead and see what happens when one hour passes. The minute hand travels all the way around the circle one time. That's one hour. So you can compare an hour to a circle. Let's turn these fractions into circles. Each circle represents an hour. And in this case, we've divided the hour into three equal parts. Two of them are shaded, two-thirds of the hour. Here we've divided the circle, the hour, into nine equal parts, and two of those are shaded, two-ninths. Two-thirds is clearly larger than two-ninths. Thirds are larger parts, ninths are smaller parts. So we take the two-thirds and we move it into the larger box, and we take the two-ninths and we put it into the smaller box. Two-ninths is smaller than two-thirds.